Welcome back. Easter is this weekend and tonight four out of 10 church going Americans say they will go in person. That's according to a Pew Research poll. Ray Preston reports on how area churches are handling Easter weekend a year into the pandemic. A year ago, this is how Justin Arinder celebrated Easter at his church, a drive in service. I can remember the excitement, uh, the joy uh, just to be able to worship and, and uh, still be able to have church. This year, it will be back inside the church with masks and social distancing. Trying to keep everybody safe. I mean, if we see that we're going to be overcrowded, we'll make uh, decisions properly uh, that we need to make. We checked with several churches around St. Louis. The churches have different approaches on how to celebrate Easter. Some are requiring reservations to meet capacity limits. The Archdiocese of St. Louis says it varies from church to church depending on COVID-19 procedures and protocols. The vast majority will stream their services online. This has been one of the most difficult seasons of ministry, and I've been doing this for 20 years. Pastor David Hawkins says his church will only be online for now. He says the congregation's grown by 40% during the pandemic. They'll go back to in-person oh, next month and go from two services to five. I'm willing to kind of put on my track shoes and accommodate people five times on Sunday. <laughs> Some church leaders we spoke with say, while online services have helped, it's also been difficult to maintain a sense of community. Being together is, is kind of crucial. That's really important for them, that support that they feel and that recognition and an acceptance. One pastor said some congregations have grown stronger as they've pulled together to fight the coronavirus during difficult times. And it's been a year of stress and strength. Ray Preston, News 4.